the Drum Exchange in Seattle. I wanted to show you this Degan 1926 marimba. It starts on a F, a half octave below middle C. There's a lot of snares in here, so apologize for that. Uh, it's a beautiful instrument. It's well in tune. Again, made in 1926, brass resonators, this is a 352B, that was probably a higher quality in the era. Heavier, a little heavier to carry around. They do come apart, which is nice. Uh, the rails have three points for temperature uh, control, and they actually mark the, the, <laughs> the temperature on there, which is rare, I don't see that. Uh, I pretty much reconditioned this thing. It's got new rope, new rubber insulators on it. I cleaned up the resonators quite a bit. Um, it's in very, very good shape. It was pretty much a single owner uh, family uh, that started this, so um, I do recommend it. Yeah, it's not a low instrument like a modern marimba, but it's also about the tenth of price of a low F, so, uh, you know, you get what you can. sound quality rosewood <laughs> interesting chord uh, it's on nice big wheels too so I'll, I'll take the camera around you can get a little closer look at it so here's the marimba a walk through here I'm gonna go down to the bottom you can see his nice big legs the resonators have some pitting on them which is typical for brass but not bad it's really pretty clean down there uh, the uh, frame is in exceptional condition here. Again, big wheels here, cross pieces, everything's operational. I think there's one bolt that's not original there. The bars, really, really good condition. Again, it's only been in one family all this time, so really exceptional condition. New ropes as well. We'll go around the front. Very good looking instrument. Here's the front. It's got the nice Deegan logo right there. You can see that. And that's where the uh, that's where the rails separate. And then the uh, you can see that. And then the uh, also the these come apart too as well. But a lot of brass on here. And then right here, what I love about it is it's got the temperature markings for where the resonators go. So there you go, won't last long. What, what is pretty interesting about this is the rails do come apart, the resonators come apart, the end pieces come out, so this actually breaks down fairly small, uh, not unlike the, the xylophone we have in stock at the moment. Uh, so if you're interested, please give us a call. Shipping is a possibility, but it could be quite pricey and weight and size of boxes, things like that. So our goal is to try and sell it locally or have somebody pick it up here. Thanks a lot. We're at drumexchange.com on the web in Seattle in near in Wallingford. Thanks a lot.